Okay everybody, welcome back to Learn With Minecraft Education. Today we are going to be looking at deleting, removing our resource and behavior packs. So over the last few months we've added lots of mods and add-ons. And uh, if you're anything like me, it can take a while to search through them and find the one that you want. So let's dive in, take a look how it's done. Okay, here we are in Minecraft Education Edition. This will work fine in Bedrock too, though. It works the exact same way. So we've got a few uh, different options here to select. We are going to go to Settings. And um, on the left hand here, we've got some different options, but we can view all of our global resources. That's Resource and Behavior Packs in uh, our Global Resources tab here. And we can scroll down, see what we've got. Now, in this menu, we can activate them, but we can't delete them. So this is really just to see them all, scroll through and uh, see what order they're in and activate them if we wanted to. We could activate them for a world that we're creating. Um, but we are today looking at deleting them, not activating. Uh, so let's um, go to a different tab here on the left. Let's go down to storage, there it is. And in our storage, we've got worlds, world templates, and there are our resource and behavior packs. So they're separate there, aren't they? Um, so let's go to resource packs and have a look through these and see what we might want to get rid of. Um, I like most of my resource packs, although I do have trouble searching through them all because there are quite a few that I don't use. And uh, those are the ones that I want to get rid of um, so that the ones I do use, I can find them a little bit quicker. So let's scroll down through our list here and we'll find one that uh, we don't want. Yeah, I don't use that one very often. So just click on it and press delete. It'll be gone forever, which is a long time. It is, and it says generating world. I'm not sure why, but then once that closes, your um, resource pack there that you selected will be gone. Now let's demonstrate how we can multi-select these as well. So we've, we can uh, select multi-select at the top, scroll through, and get rid of a whole bunch of them. So it might be that you don't want any more of them saved on there. You don't want any resource or behavior packs and you wanted to get rid of them all. You can multi-select to get rid of them all and delete the content there. Um, and that's it, that's how it works. So uh, we'll head over in a minute to a new game and, and see how many of our resource packs are available. It should be less, it was 56 before. Uh, so if I go to create new and I go down to my resource packs it's down to 51, so I've deleted quite a few there. I need to go through and find a few more. Uh, but that's how it's done, guys. Um, so do make sure you go through and uh, delete a few of those. Have a bit of a spring clean on your resource and behavior packs because they do build up over time, okay? Right, I hope you found today's video useful. Please do like this video and, if you can, subscribe to the channel it's a really good way to help out what we're doing here okay and i will see you all for more videos later on in the week